Hi everyone, Keyless Entry here. Uh, today, just got this uh, Lockwood Us Abloy rim cylinder in here. I think it's a 201 cylinder, but don't quote me on that. Um, I do have another one here, which is definitely a 201, so I'm not sure if it's a different model or some, like a aftermarket replacement for an older model. But um, yeah, this one's a five pin and that's a six pin there. Alrighty, so this one contains the uh, Asa Abloy thin-lipped spools and I wanted to uh, pick it today with one of the beautiful picks that I received from the butcher's block so that's the profile there just love using this pick so I was a bit hesitant using it at the start but I thought you know he's made them for me to use so why not use them all right so there's your bitting as you can see nothing too crazy I've, I've picked the hell out of this locker <laughs> Uh, when I was learning these spools, so do know, do, do know this lock quite well, and the bidding's not that great either. But get a chance to use this one. All right, let's go for it. So we'll go clockwise, uh, counterclockwise. Zoom in a little bit. There we go. All right. So okay, I've got a counter on one, two. Three, four, five, and then we've got an open. I'll put it clockwise too. This feels silky smooth in the keyway too. It's just so smooth. So when when you're riding that warding, it's just it's like yeah, like on you're on ice, just skating on ice. No no friction, whatever, whatsoever. Sorry. One, two. Three, four, five, there we go. Alrighty, I'll just give it a quick go and show you guys what's inside. Okay, so we lock it back up. It's got one of these clips on there, C clips, which isn't too bad to get off. You just sort of got to bend them off because they go through here. So they sort of get stuck in there, and then you can bend this part off a little bit like that. Get out with the screwdriver, he says. There we go. All right. Okay, get the key, and I still don't have any shims. <laughs> Pray to the lock gods once more. And uh, all right, here we go. Right, there we go. So I think this one's got. I haven't gutted this in a while. So it looks like it's got lab pins, and I've lost the spool already. See, look at that. I didn't pray to the lock gods enough. There we go. All right. See if I've damaged any springs. Ah, gutting disaster. Okay, where did that spool come out from? Might have been the last one. So that's one. So all these spools are the same. Three. There's four. I think he was in out of position five. So if I didn't mangle the spring too much. Oh, look at that. Well, there you go, I'm only human. Yeah, just might need to replace that one. Oopsies. <laughs> All right, there we go. Cool. Just bring these up so you guys can see. There we go. So we've got those uh, lab key pins and these very, very nice, I love these spools, the Asa Abloy Lockwood Shallow Spools. Picked by this beautiful pick from uh, the Butcher's Block. Stunning pick. I love using this. It's very nice wood. Look at that craftsmanship around there. Yeah, very, very nice. Don't use it too often, but... I thought, you know, I'll be using it. Why not film it? Anyway, guys, that's it from me. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see you guys next time. Take care.